Hey, it's Romano here from Blue Rocket Accounting. Today I'm going to be showing you how to use the balance sheet and how to make use of it in Xero. For those of you who don't know what a balance sheet is, it's a report which summarizes an organization's current financial position, um, detailing the assets and the liabilities in a given period. So once you have Xero open and you are logged in, all we're going to do is go up to the accounting tab and drop it down and hit on reports. From here, you should see all the types of reports you can download and run. We're going to go under financials and hit the balance sheet. So now the balance sheet is open, what you can do is at the top, you can modify your date. Um, for example, you may want to run it for the end of the financial year or do it on a quarterly basis or monthly basis. Um, we'll change it to a monthly basis for now. Um, next to it, you can compare periods. For example, if you set the period to June, you can then filter it to show free periods. And once you update the balance sheet, it will show you the periods beforehand. Um, this is very useful in terms of comparing um, different months. Now at the top, you can filter to um, different types of groups, however you want it. And if we hit more, you can change your accounting basis, whether you do reports based on accrual basis or cash accounting. So this is the balance sheet. It will show you all your assets and all your liabilities. And at the bottom, it will show you your capital. Um, from here, if you wish to download the report, we simply go to the bottom right of the screen and hit export. And here you can download it however you like. Most people like to download it in a PDF format. from here you see it just on the top here if you don't have this it may it may drop it down into your documents from here we can open it up and here we are it runs it just just as you will see in zero um, it runs the same report um, and you can print that however you like if you are on the zero you can also click into each account where where you see the blue figures if you just click onto them it will then open up that separate account and give you a more detailed view of what transactions have happened in the balance sheet. Um, so that's really much it for the balance sheet. If you have any questions, feel free to contact the office, um, give us a call, drop us an email, we're more than happy to help. Thank you for watching. It's Romano here from Blue Rocket Accounting. It's not rocket science, it's just great accounting.